right, so I need a second or two because if you notice on the last video, my phone takes a second to pick up the audio, but don't know why. Anyways, um, welcome back to another one of my shorter videos here on Gunpowder and Freedom. Thank you to all my new subscribers that came over from Outdoors with the Morgans. Um, I'm usually a lot better with posting content, but if you've seen any of the previous short videos, uh, my computer, which is right there, crapped the bed on me and uh, had to get this new setup. So uh, working through the process of getting everything set up, I was hoping to have everything up and running so I could start making some of the videos that I have filmed. I think I, at this point I have like 12 or 13 different videos filmed. I just need my editing program back up so that I can get content put together and get it out there for you guys. I'm pretty excited for what I have coming, but here's my new computer. Shout out to my brother-in-law, Julian, for helping me build this. Uh, I kind of put together a parts list for him. Look at that nice shiny glass case. Hello. <laughs> um, but he made some corrections, got me set up, um, but running into a slight problem now. And this is actually why I'm posting this, because if anybody can help me figure out how to get this up and running, how to fix this problem, um, I will gladly send you out a t-shirt and how about a hoodie too? If you can help me figure this out, I will get, get you a t-shirt and a hoodie, provided I have a hoodie in, in this size. I think I have uh, an extra large, a large a large and maybe a 2x i'm not sure but anyways here is my problem um so here is my camera right there this is all of the footage i have just on this camera now if i click this and the little symbol right there that's for the vlc media player that's just the icon they use so if you click on that okay. there's the video Yesterday, for my ak-47 review so you can see it plays it, the computer supports it, the audio is there, it's an MP4 file format. Now, the problem I have is this. When I go to the Premiere Projects folder and open up one of the uh, last auto saves that were done on one of my, uh, the video I was actually doing on this computer when it crapped the bed, um, you can see I'll open it up. And the new computer really opens it up fast. Um, number one, nothing's in the workspace bar. I had about half of this video done when it auto-saved. Um, now it says, where is the file? Big Tripod 001, which, um, I mean, it's in the footage folder. Um, it's on my external hard drive. Uh, we copied that over to the desktop uh, here out of the working. So here is that file. It should play, but I get this message and I'm gonna hold it here for a second so you can read it. Um, I have no idea what that means. Um, we've, Julian and I have tried several different media players um, because some of the threads that I use said that uh, Adobe Premiere Elements um, needs the Windows media player to support the MP4 files. Uh, however, we tried that. It didn't work. Um, back to square one where I'm just trying to read through a bunch of threads and figure out. Oh, here's also another thing. So the camera's there. You just saw it's hooked up. Um, when I go to add media from the camera, <sighs> none of the files are there because it's not reading the MP4 file format. So... Oh, and then for whatever reason, it does pull up like these files. But then if I drag it down to the toolbar, that's what I get. So I really have no idea what to do. Um, you know, like I've said, we've tried several. Um, we've tried several media players. Uh, I went and bought Windows 11 because something with the Windows 10, I don't know, I read that maybe it was a little out of date, I don't know, so I bought that. That's not working. If anybody 
can help me figure out why this is not working. I will send you a Gunpowder and Freedom t-shirt as well as a hoodie provided I uh, have it in your size. So leave me a comment, drop me some links to anything that you think might be helpful. Um, you know, I'm still filming things, but I just have no way to edit it right now until I get this up and running. The amount of money that I just put into this whole setup, um, you know, I really don't want to just go buy another computer. That would kind of be pointless to have all this. So, um, yeah, thank you in advance for anybody that can offer me some help and some invite. And, uh, hopefully I am producing more content here shortly. So thank you.